What's up guys, Albert here with Ballista Archery and today we are going to talk about our Picatinny rail. Now, let's get started. There's not much to it other than that it's a Picatinny rail and that it's five and three quarters inches long. Now, some of you might be wondering why we even have these and why we offer them, um, especially to those of you that are newer to Ballista and aren't familiar with us. Um, popular things to build with these Picatinny rails are these crossbows. So as you can see, pretty modded out little crossbow. We got a couple of videos on YouTube on how to build this. And this is all thanks to the bottom Picatinny rail. We have a real, real attachment, flashlight, and a nice little handle. But you don't have to stop there. You can get as creative as you want. And there are tons of accessories on, on the internet, on the web, that you can attach to Picatinny rails. So to the right of me, uh, I kind of got a big mess right here going on. And we're just going to mess around and see what we can build using the Picatinny rail. But first, obviously, we need to install it. So what we're going to do, it's very easy, simple to install. You just throw it on your crossbow. All right, so we got the bottom Picatinny rail on. And obviously, we can throw on a fishing rig on here and make a crossbow bow fishing rig. So we can do that, and then we can add a number of other accessories like lasers, flashlights, uh, et cetera, et cetera. But I don't want to spend too much time on this because we have other videos on this. So we got dedicated videos on how to build super compact bow fishing rigs. Um, so I'm not going to focus on that too much today. However, what I do want to focus on is some stuff that you guys might not be familiar with. So one of the first things that comes to mind, um, that I just think is really cool is being able to attach a camera to the crossbow. Yes, you heard me right. Check this out. Oops. So this right here is a little camera adapter, um, to Picatinny mount and I shoot with the Action 3, so it's just an action camera. If you have the GoPro, this will work the same way. You can even use your phone. So just this little small adapter, tiny little adapter. Um, so I'm going to attach the reel, the handle first, just because I have the handle on all my crossbows, just because it's very comfortable. Um, so we're going to attach this first. All right, so we got the handle on. You guys are familiar with this handle. Now what I'm gonna go ahead and do is attach this little mount and show you guys what I'm talking about. So um, I'm just gonna attach it like this. I'm gonna grab my little adapter and these usually come with, with action cameras. All right, so check this out. One of the options you can do with this is attach a camera to this and you can film your hunts, uh, your expeditions, just like this. It's pretty dang cool. Um, and you get kind of like a different perspective, different angle for your hunting videos. So this is actually really cool little, little setup, but we don't have to stop here. We got a couple other accessories that we can attach and uh, little different things we can do. So let's just say you want to attach a laser, right? You can attach a long, one of those longer lasers and attach one of these offsets just like this. Put the laser in there, put the flashlight in there. Or you might just have one of these little tactical uh, laser flashlights sitting around at home. What you can do is grab one of these uh, offsets. I think this is one one inch offset and you can also throw this on. So let's just do that real quick. Uh, 
All right, guys, so check this out. I'm just having fun with this. I'm not putting too much thought into it. I'm not going to be doing this on mine just because I don't need to put all these accessories all at once. But, however, for your guys' sake, just to show you guys how awesome this is, just check this out. There's a laser right here, right? And you got a flashlight. And this is all mounted right on. And you got, a, and you got an action camera to record everything too. So if you're bow fishing, if you're hunting, you just have a nice little camera recording right here. You got a flashlight right here. And I mean, I don't have the bow fishing rig on this, but I'm sure you can make it work. Maybe not with the camera, but with the laser and flash or flashlight, you definitely can. So you can have this little adapter, right? Or you can throw on one of these bigger offsets and throw on a flashlight. So let's do that right now and just kind of see, see how that looks like, see how that feels. All right, so one of my all-time favorite things to do is adding a flashlight just like this. But we're going to take this one step, one step further and I'm going to show you guys something really cool. I'll be back. So check this out. This is one of the coolest things I've done so far and I love it. So we got the flashlight, we got the action camera, and I have a tripod here and this is for when I'm hunting. I can just let my crossbow sit. It's not sitting on the ground. Really good stabilization. Plus for recording, I, I need stable, stable footage for recording. And right here we got the part at night vision uh, site. I have a full we have a video on hog hunting with it and kill shot and everything. So for me, it's really important to have a very stable rest for uh, great quality footage. So check this out. You slap with that crossbow. You can get one of these adapters. You slap your crossbow on and now you are just good to go. So check it out. You got a flashlight on you. You got a camera recording and you have night vision set up, and you have an ultra stable, ultra, just like, just super steady little setup, good to go. So that's pretty awesome. And I'm just showing you guys all of these things to show you guys how creative you guys can get with, with these Picatinny rails. You can add just endless, endless little accessories. So I just showed you guys within the matter of a few minutes, four or five different things you guys can do. All right guys, so that's pretty much a wrap for today's video. And I really just wanted to show you guys how creative you guys can get with these Picatinny rails. This is a hack to build your dream crossbow. All right guys, so that's pretty much the end of this video. And I just really wanted to show you guys how creative you guys can get with these Picatinny rails. Now, I didn't even go all out. You can just get as creative as you want. Um, I just kind of threw everything together to show you guys that there are options for you to do. Like I said, this is one of my coolest favorite options um, for hunting. You got your camera rolling. You got a flashlight in the dark. You got your your night vision on top. You just just so, so cool, you know? Then you have bow fishing. You know, I went, we went bow fishing a few nights ago and you got a laser, you got a flashlight, you got a fishing reel on here. So opportunities are endless. As creative as you want, you can build your dream crossbows. So I highly recommend uh, picking up one of the bottom Picatinny rails uh, from our website. I'll leave a link to everything down below. And I thank you guys so much for watching. Send us pictures of your guys' built crossbows. I'd love to see them. Tag us in your posts and your photos. We would gladly repost and reshare. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.